We're getting sandblasted in Blackpool tonight. Wow, look at that. Oh my goodness, there's a hole in the marquee there, look. It's been torn, oh. Oh, dearest. Look at that. That is crazy. It's getting pretty serious now, folks. Welcome to another video. We walk on the wild side and I'm here in a bit of a wild and windy Blackpool. It's just after six o'clock on Sunday, October the 20th, and uh, we've got Storm Ashley. Look at this, can you see all these bushes here blowing? Storm Ashley is hitting Blackpool right now. We've got gusts of up to 70 miles an hour this evening. We've got a yellow alert for, for wind and uh, it could cause some damage. I'm on Rigby Road at the moment, just across the road from Blackpool Transport, just over there. And I'm gonna, it, you know, the wind doesn't actually seem that bad at the moment, but uh, we'll see what it's like on the promenade, shall we? Because it's obviously gonna be a lot more exposed on the promenade, so let's go and check it out, shall we? We're just about getting the strongest winds right any time in the next hour or so. So this is Rigby Road and uh, these are the new Foxhall Village houses just here and as I walk this way we get towards where they're building a new phase. Now what have we got here? It looks like we've got a scaffolding collapse book, look at this! Oh my goodness! Check it out! Look at this! Look at... What a mess! Look at that folks, did the wind do this? Oh my goodness! Look at that! Let's have a look from over the road shall we? I'll just head over the road. There's a Blackpool Transport where all the buses go. There's a building there, the headquarters, and just across the road is where they're building a load of new houses. And as you can see, look at that. Oh, wowzers. The massive scaffolding collapse there, look. Wow. Well, at least it's contained within inside the, the site. It's not come outside, but there's a bit of a mess there, folks, to uh, sort out. Look at this. You can see a load of, look at this, look. It is a bit wild, but yeah, look at that. Wowzers. Didn't expect to see that. <laughs> yeah, look at that, folks. We've got a scaffolding collapse there, look. Wowzers. So we've got some houses here which look like they're almost complete. I'm not really sure what these houses start at. But where these houses stand used to be quite industrial, but also a lot of hotels as well. They knocked down a whole row of hotels on Tilsley Road just up here to build a load of these houses. But there was another street round the back there called Blundell Street. Now that had hotels on it as well, but it also had some businesses. I remember Charlie Bodgers. Who remembers Charlie Bodgers Body Shop on Blundell Street? We used to go there all the time. This is Tilsley Road now. And if we look this way, might be able to see the tower. Check it out. Oh, look at that Blackpool Tower. So you can see on the right hand side, that's where they knocked down all the hotels to build the new housing estate. But let's carry on. I'm heading to Manchester Square, just up here, Manchester Square. Ooh. Probably be a bit windier up here on the on the promenade. I can feel it a bit now. Coming at me. What's it like for people? Well, there's quite a few brave people out tonight. Look at this, look. It's quite busy. This is Manchester Square. There's the Manchester over there. It doesn't actually feel too bad at the moment. 
and uh, as you can see there's quite a few people around look at this the land out there look check it out I thought uh, it would be fairly quiet tonight you know with all this storm Ashley going on they are predicting 70 mile an hour winds at around about 9 o'clock, 10 o'clock. But look at this, just outside the, the Royal Sea Bank and there's loads of people, loads of people around. There's loads of people in the hotel. Yeah, it's looking pretty busy in Blackpool at the moment. I'm going to head up here a bit. We'll head up to the central pier and uh, and beyond and we'll see what it's like up there shall we i wanted to see if any of the light pool exhibits were getting a bit of a battering because i mentioned on a previous video that the, they're going to have to stand up to this wind aren't they oh it's a nice looking sunset anyway nice looking uh, sky out there you know it's surprising really it's uh, it doesn't seem that bad at all really and it hasn't seemed to have put anybody off coming on the promenade tonight Storm Ashley uh, I know we haven't got the worst of it yet but uh, it's not too far off I said I checked before and the wind speeds were about 65 mile an hour gusting at the moment they're going to get up to 70 so there's not a whole lot of difference really is there? but anyway there you go just going to make it across the road here we go Oh, get a look at the Blackpool illuminations. Oh, we're getting to the bright lights now, folks. The big wheel's not lit up like no, like it normally is. Maybe if uh, the, a bit too windy to go on the big wheel. What do you reckon? I think the waltz is going. Oh, anyway, I'm just walking along this new path. This is a new path, by the way, that the council made along this grass verge here because people were trailing all over it and just wearing it out. So the council must have thought, well, we'll just build a path along here, shall we? Because everyone's using it. Oh, and by the way, at the moment, I'm getting blasted with sand. Oh, look at this. Oh, it's whipping up now, folks. Oh, my goodness. Oh, the poor horse. Oh my goodness, look at that. Oh, the sand is really getting going now. Oh, <laughs> this is crazy, folks. Wow, <laughs> look at that. Oh. I hope they don't have the horses out too long tonight because they're getting blasted by sand now. Oh dear, poor horses. Oh. Dearest folks, it's crazy. Oh, proper illuminations weather now, isn't it? You know, I can't believe it. All I did was just cross the road. And when I crossed the road, it just, it just seemed to whip, the wind just seemed to whip up. And now we're getting all this sand blowing all over the place. It's, it's mental. Look at this. Can you see that? Can you see it blowing across the... Look at that, that is amazing. We're getting sandblasted in Blackpool tonight. Wow, look at that. That is crazy. <laughs> oh my goodness. Look at this. Oh. Now it's getting a little bit hard to stand up now. Oh my goodness, it really is getting going now. I can't believe it. <laughs> When I started off, it was nothing. It was just a, a bit of a breeze, but now look at it. Oh my goodness, that is crazy. Oh, there goes the, the Western train tramp. <laughs> they won't have the open, the open one on tonight, will they? Look at all the sand in front of the central pier. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, look at this, <laughs> that's crazy.
crazy. But there's still lots of people about, look. And we've still got the land out. Oh, dearest. My goodness. Oh, it's, I've got a mouthful then. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, this is the view into the wind. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I've got a mouthful of sand there then. <laughs> Oh. It all, swir all seems to swirl around here, you know. I think this seems to be the part of the promenade where you get most of the, the sand whipping up it, around the central pier. It always seems to happen. That's looking down Chapel Street. We're not too far from the one pound burger, just down there on the right hand side. But yeah, it's a bit mental. It's a bit mental now. We've got a bit of a sandstorm going on here in Blackpool. <laughs> well, there's always excitement in Blackpool, isn't there? And I think people are having a little bit of fun as well. The tide's out, which is good. Um, so it's only we're only getting battered by dry sand. We're not getting battered by spray and salt and all that sort of stuff. Well, I can hear Pete. Is that Pete on the bingo over there? Oh, he's so busy. We're doing pretty well today at Happy Days Amusements here in Blackpool. Check them out if you come. If you're a bingo fan, check out the bingo there. Oh, look at this. Seems to have calmed down now that I've got past the, north, the central pier. Seems to have calmed down a bit. Yeah, it's, it's funny that. Just around the central pier, it just seems to kick off with the sand. Oh, we've got Odyssey now. Look at that, doesn't it look amazing? With the twilight sky behind it. Hey, by the way, there's a comet out there somewhere, folks. There's a comet, yeah? Out towards the west after sunset. If you look hard enough, you might see a comet. If you want to see it, you might have to use binoculars though, because it is moving away from us. But yeah, there is a comet out there, folks. But this is Odyssey. As you can see, there's quite a lot of people on the promenade. How are you doing? You all right? Okay, I'm going to leave Odyssey behind. I'm going to just head down onto the beach. This will be interesting. I want to go down and give you the experience of standing on Blackpool Beach in a sandstorm. Can you hear that? Just listen. <laughs> oh. Well, I'm not the only one down here. <laughs> I'm not the only crazy person. Look at this. Oh, that is epic, folks. Look at that. That is crazy. Whoa. Oh, my goodness. Oh. I'm getting proper sandblasted now. Oh my God. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> Fancy a ride on the big wheel. It's only a bit of wind. Look at this. I feel like Lawrence of Arabia. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh, we've got some people over here with cameras and a tri tripod set up and everything. God, even I'm not that hardcore. My goodness. I wouldn't want to get sand all in my camera. Oh, goodness me. Well, I can hear Simons now, it's kicking off in Blackpool. 
But anyway, I'm going to head back onto the promenade again. <laughs> I've had enough sand blasting for now. Oh, let's get up this ramp here. Oh, I'm taking a bit of punishment tonight, folks. <laughs> so you don't have to. Uh, that's what makes Blackpool special, you see. It doesn't matter what the weather, it doesn't put the people off. Look at this. Oh. Just going past the RNLI now, and as you can see, we've got another bit here that it whips up here as well. Oh. <laughs> it just looks like a cloud of sand across the promenade. Can you see that? Oh, here comes the, the train. Ah. Let's get a close up, shall we? Oh, get the ding ding from the, from the train. Oh, no. Get out of the way, get out of the way. Here we go. To get this one there it is that's what we wanted isn't it oh, just got a wave there off the, the guards on there so shout out to you guys oh the bright lights of blackpool in a sandstorm Here's a look at Coral Island. Oh. Uh. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's crazy, folks. Storm Ashley is pounding Blackpool now, and we've got this. Pretty awesome sandstorm. The baubles are all lit up. <laughs> this one isn't. Oh my god, my face is. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. <laughs> oh. What's it like on the comedy carpet? This one's not lit up. This turn this one off the jellyfish one oh. I think they've got a bit of a job on with this marquee I think I can't believe this but that marquee has oh my goodness there's a hole in the marquee there look it's been torn oh oh my goodness this is uh not looking too pretty, folks. Oh, they've got a job on here to keep this marquee. Oh, my goodness. It's getting pretty serious now, folks. Look at that. And they've got an exhibit in there called Flux, and they're having a job to keep it. Oh, oh, my goodness. Well, it's... Uh, Oh my god, honestly, that thing, it could blow away, honestly. The marquee is in danger of being taken away. Oh my god, folks. I think they've got to take it down. I think they've got to take it down. I can't believe it. It's in danger of being blown away. So I've made it here to the comedy carpet in front of the Blackpool sign, the projection unit for Lightpool. There's a few people out here, brave souls. And just over there, the council has got a bit of a job on with the marquee. I think they might have had to remove that piece of artwork that was in there. And at the moment, they seem to be trying to secure it, but I really hope that it doesn't blow away because it's not looking too stable at the moment, but uh, I think I'll probably wrap it up there now anyway. So let's have a look at the tower, shall we? Oh my dear. It's whipping up now, folks. Uh, it's uh, 
well compared to when i started it's it's pretty bad now and it's getting a little bit dangerous now to be quite honest i hope that the council can sort out that marquee it looks like they're going to have to take it down because it's not going to stay up it's not going to stay up in this wind i don't think so i'm going to leave it there now folks that was storm actually as it hit blackpool um, I'm I'm going to go on now. It's it's getting too hectic now. This it's it's getting a bit dangerous. But uh, anyway, there you go. That's it for this video. I hope you liked the video. If you do, hit the like button and also hit subscribe and tick the bell for notifications of new videos. And I'll see you again on the next one. Oh my goodness.